So let's see this delicious Mexican rice recipe. Now here I have 200 grams of mushrooms thinly sliced, one medium capsicum diced into small cubes, two orange carrots diced into small cubes, one cup of beans, one cup of boiled corn, one medium onion cubed. This is one green chili half an inch of ginger and six large cloves of garlic really chopped fine one fourth cup of cilantro or coriander one and a half cup of cooked basmati two tablespoons of this tex-mex taco seasoning you can use any brand and some salt to taste so here i'm heating two tablespoons of olive oil in a pan once the oil, uh, I don't want the oil to get heated up, so I'm going to immediately add the sliced up mushrooms. We're going to fry the mushrooms for two minutes. So don't heat your olive oil, immediately add the mushrooms and fry them for about two minutes. After two minutes, you're just going to transfer them to a bowl. Now in the same oil, I'm going to add the finely chopped ginger, garlic and green chili. Saute this for a whole minute. Next, I'm going to be adding the onion. Fry the onion also well. Next, we're going to add the capsicum. Fry the capsicum well, then go in the carrots, fry the carrots well and now we're just going to add the beans and the boiled corn. Mix everything really nicely. So this is a real healthy dish packed with lots of veggies. Now I'm going to add the mushrooms back in. So mushrooms are a good source of vitamin D. Mix everything really well. Now we're going to add some salt to taste. I'm also going to add one teaspoon of pepper powder. Sorry, I didn't mention it in the ingredients. Mix everything well. And now I'm going to add the rice. So I'm using cooked uh, basmati rice. I leave instructions in the description box as to how I prepare my rice so that all the grains are separated. I also have a video of how I cook it. So I leave a link to that video below in the description and the comment section. Now mix all of this really well together. So this is a great uh, tiffin recipe. This is a great recipe when you have surprise guest or a nice light lunch. Cover and cook this for just two minutes so that everything comes together. Give it one good mix. Turn off the heat. And now you're going to add the taco seasoning. So I've gone with two tablespoons, but you can give it a good mix and then give it a taste test and see if you need to add more. So I'm just going to give it a taste test. Everything looks good. So now I'm just going to add the chopped up coriander. And our lovely Mexican rice is all ready to enjoy. Do give this recipe a try guys. It's really really delicious. recipe a try share my recipes with family and friends go and visit my channel i have more than 500 recipes as of today so go try them out share them with family and friends and let me know also in the comment section below how you like the recipe also don't forget to give this recipe a big thumbs up by clicking the thumbs up icon that you see below this video if you haven't joined akshita's recipes yet 
click the subscribe button that you see below this video and become a part of Akshita's recipes. And once you have subscribed, there's a little bell icon that will pop up. Just click it. That way, whenever I put up a new video, a recipe, vlog, or I'm just online uh, waiting to chat with you, you'll get a message for the same. So friends, thank you so much for watching today's video. And I will catch you in my next video sooner than you think. This is Akshata saying bye. Take care, stay healthy, stay fit. Be loving and kind to one another. So till I see you in my next video. Bye.